Hey, what's up guys? My name is TJ and guess what? In this video today for you sales pros, I'm going over exactly how you guys can be selling a car a day, all right? And if you guys wanna learn more about marketing, sales, and lead gen for car sales, or sales in general, then shoot me a message, see if I can help you out uh, on Facebook, or just book a time to speak with me down below in the link. And my goal for you is even if you pay me a dime or you don't, uh, with my content, I hope it's valuable enough to help you guys make thousands of dollars in sales. And I mean that genuinely, all right? And so, that being said, again, so let's let's dive straight into this. I'm ex really excited about this um, concept. It's really dope. It's all possible for you guys to actually be selling a car a day, all right? So let's kind of break down how do you even do that in the first place. So, I wanna to explain to you guys what exactly a prospect is, okay? So when people say prospecting, what does that mean? What does prospecting mean? It gets thrown around a lot. I hear, the words that I hear get thrown around all, uh, a ton is marketing, branding, and prospecting. I hear that all the time, just getting tossed around like it's nobody's business. And so uh, a prospect is a potential customer, all right? And so prospecting is starting conversations with, guess what, a potential customer. And so, one of the rules and laws of the car business is that one to three percent of the market is always ready to purchase a vehicle, right? And so if you break that down, if you want to find people who are ready to purchase a vehicle, guess what? At the bare minimum, at the most, you have to talk to at least a hundred people a day, right? And if you break that down, you know, the other two to three percent could be 50 to 33 people a day. So easy to do that. And so I'm gonna show you guys exactly how you guys can be getting in front of that many people and talking to them, et cetera, et cetera. But that's that core principle that you guys have to keep in mind, okay? Well, now that I know that I only have to talk to 100 people a day, how do I do that, right? That's the next thing you guys can kind of think of. And so our goal is to reach as many people, as many new people in a day as humanly possible so we can find people who are ready. And so this is, having actual conversations, talking to somebody, and you know, ha getting them to respond and you know, have a conversation to see if we can help them out. So, I wanna just kind of explain to you guys a concept that when it comes to prospecting, you know, it's just not one and done, right? Like one prospect, one potential prospect, even if they're not ready to buy right now, they know people, people know people. And so, that being said, Whenever you do prospect, you want to ask if you know they know somebody that's in the market that's ready to purchase a vehicle, um, even if they're not. And when you are, guess what? You're planting seeds and asking for referrals. So that's one of the most important things when it comes to prospecting for you guys in car sales because. If you guys read anything, there's a book called Banana for Prospect, and everyone's a prospect. And prospects are more valuable because they know somebody. People know other people. And so that concept can be applied to all the methods that I'm gonna show you guys are gonna talk about today, all right? So kind of this concept of, okay, one to many, right? So ways you can kind of leverage your time. Uh, I'm gonna talk about a few of them right now. So first off, I'm gonna start off with posting on your social media. Okay, so kind of explaining to a ton of your friends list on your Instagram, Facebook, that you are, one, either selling a car, how you can help them in a specific situation if you're helping them with, you know, bad credit situations, um, and market yourself in a way or run a promotion saying, hey, guess what, you know, we have a, a deal on XYZ car, or we're having a deal, or if you have bad credit, come and shop with me. That's getting your message in front of plenty of people. So post on social media. Another one is posting on listing sites so you can post on Marketplace, Craigslist, Kijiji. Uh, what's, what's another one? Offer up, right? So posting on listing sites so you're then getting in front of more people uh, and having people reaching out to you. So that's kind of stops you from doing some of the legwork. That's why I put these first two first. Um, these are like a, uh, I'll, I'll draw a bad magnet, you know? Uh, these right here are magnets. And so 
Uh, the next thing you guys can do is uh, work your guys' customer base, all right? You guys can do that at all points in time. You guys should be keeping track of all your customers, and in a day, you should be reaching out to all of them, either via text, phone call, whatever it is, and asking them for referrals or if they're ready to buy a car. If you've been in the car business long enough, you know, two, three years, people are usually coming back to purchase a vehicle. And so work your customer base, right? People know other people, and guess what? These guys are gonna be great people to ask you, ask because they've already done business with you, they know who you are, they've already gone through you once. So next thing, sending out last text and email. So this, depending on your guys' CRM, you guys can set up and send out a ton of um, text emails to your people, right? So th these are all things that you guys can do within a day. Uh, the next thing is start conversations on social media. So that's just direct messaging people, starting a conversation, whoever is in your network or whoever you see online, uh, shoot them a DM, see if you can help out. And then next thing are making cold calls, right? So that is, you know, to your guys' equity mining list, um, just a cold calling list, a, um, you know, in an interest list. Just make calls. You can literally make 20, 30, 40, 50 calls in a day relatively, you know, with some effort. And you guys can combine some of this other stuff to, you know, hit, hit your goal of 100 for the day. And so the next thing is go to networking events, right? So, you know, on the weekends going out to, you know, like whatever events, car meets, um, you know, like a business event, uh, wine tasting, I don't know, <laughs> whatever is local to you guys, whatever you guys like, festivals, fairs, whatever, go and shake some hands, go and meet some people. The more strangers you talk to, the more money you make, right? This is a numbers game at the end of the day. So one of the things you guys have to put in mind, sales is a numbers game. So that's why we kind of break it down. We have to get these numbers. So last but not least is sending out postcards and flyers out to, you know, local neighbors and towns um, where, you know, you have potential prospects there and getting that message in front of them saying, hey, give me a call if you are you know, looking for a new vehicle, struggling with bad credit, et cetera, et cetera. So just to put this into perspective, like guys, almost all of these, well, these you can kind of do sometimes, but all of these you can do in a day. There's no excuses to not be hitting up, you know, anywhere from between 30 to 100 people a day. It's very simple, it's very easy. And so, it's, okay, let me put it this way. It's, it's simple, I'm not gonna say it's easy, but it's doable, all right? So that just takes some hard grind time. And so, all you guys who sit at your guys' dealership, you know, and you guys are twiddling your thumbs trying to wait for that next lead to come on in, go do this, go do this. Go freaking prospect and go get some leads, you know? <laughs> and so, that being said, you know, I talked to a lot of you guys, and the biggest problem that you guys have is, oh, damn, like, you know, I spend most of my day just kind of chilling at the dealership. And so, yeah, you guys complain about working 10 hours a day, but how much of that time is actually working? There you go. And so, you know, on the slow days, when there's times where there's not anything to do, fill your time with doing these things. You have no excuses. And so, all you guys now know how to sell a car a day. Getting in front of 100 people, starting a conversation with 100 to 33 people a day based off the rule and principle of the 1% to 3% um, that the market's always looking. So that's our goal. That's how prospecting works. That's how you guys can sell a car every single day. Hope this, value was uh, hope this video was valuable for you guys. And I'll catch you guys in another one. Bye.